Live music is essential to a pub atmosphere, especially when local talent is showcased. The open mic pub event transforms Stu's cafeteria into a bar scene. Students were able to enjoy a night out, even if they are underage. All students were welcome to the event, but a government ID was required in order to buy liquor. Beer was a popular choice for most, but one student felt that too many drinks can cause disruption. I think it's fine. Like if a lot, I think a lot of people are responsible and have a few drinks and like makes their night better and that's fine. I just don't like when people go like overboard and get smashed at an event like this. With alcohol available for purchase, the event brought in students from all over. Yeah, we've actually got a pretty diverse crowd out for tonight. There's some students that I know are first years from the residences. Um, we have a lot of upper years that come as well. And, um, so. But we also had some off-campus students, which was nice to have an event where the off-campus students felt welcome within the residence community. Students say they were also attracted to the event as the majority of the featured musicians were students themselves. The pub night gave them a chance to display their talents in a relaxed and casual setting. While good food and entertainment was provided, it was the students coming out that made the event a success. Organizers say that with its great turnout, they expect to hold many more pub nights in the near future. For Stu Journalism, I'm Allison Too Good.